Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today in The Sims 4, I wanted to build with the new Cozy Kitsch kit. And I don't know, it's so beautiful. It comes with like a full living room set. It comes with these beautiful bookshelves. And I pretty much want to use all the items here. It also comes with this beautiful dining table and these chairs. So to think about the floor plan, I was kind of thinking we could do like two bedrooms. And then maybe we could do like a big bathroom. That was kind of my idea. Or this could be the bathroom and then this could be like a very small office space and then we could possibly have the kitchen on this wall and then the living room over here so it might be a little weird the way that i'm going to be building this but i kind of want to get all the stuff that i want to use out i'm just so excited to like use this stuff and i wanted to go with like this yellow color and i don't know i like the pink but do you think we could like do pink orange and yellow or is that a little bit weird i just don't know if that would look good together. I also don't think there's a pink swatch on the rug so that kind of makes it very- oh I guess this is a pink swatch. So we could do like the blue, pink, and yellow and then I want to go for this color because this color is cute and then if we look at the dining chairs they come in like the pink, they also come in the blue, they also come in the yellow and then maybe we could do like white. I think we can make this color scheme work and then we have a beautiful checkered fireplace like that's so gorgeous but maybe we could do it in the blue color or or the yellow or we could just do plain white but that's kind of boring so i'm gonna try the blue and then i feel like we need a little bit more yellow so i'm gonna take these end pieces and i'm gonna like scoot them into the fireplace as if they were built in like that is pretty nice and then we have like this beautiful artwork this looks so good above the fireplace but maybe we'll get a tv instead so it could go above these chairs like that's really cute maybe in that color i'm gonna put these flowers on this table so maybe I could use that in one of the bedrooms maybe or maybe that's a bad idea maybe in the office and then I could probably use the shelves in the office as well I'm gonna put down these books part of me is wondering if we should go back to this color scheme you know I'm very indecisive I mean who isn't indecisive also this poof could probably go into one of the bedrooms as well and then I'll use like the full bookshelf maybe in the office oh and then we have like this very cute stepping stool so I'm gonna put this light maybe next to the chairs maybe like this or maybe over here actually over here looks better i'm gonna put this fruit bowl on the table Ooh, the red apples are cute and then i'll put these candles in the bedroom maybe so this has to be used maybe this could also go in the bedroom i'm also thinking of like putting a bump out right here so maybe that's where this could go these are some very big bedrooms and then we have this light switch we have a neon sign and then we also have this beautiful painting and then i'll get this light above the dining table that is so pretty and then i think that's it i think i pretty much used everything from this pack so i'm gonna use the eco lifestyle flooring and then i could probably use the dream home decorator doors in the hallway this is a pretty big hallway but i think that is okay look this is already so cute like with all the furniture out i think that is just adorable so in the kitchen i imagined using like this yellow counter from Home Chef Hustle because it is so pretty. Do I have to use that window? It looks like it. I could just delete it with the tool. I might use everything Home Chef Hustle because I think that would look good. And then with the tool mod, for me, I'm just going to delete this window. And I think I will probably put my own window there just so it's like in the middle of the stove. That just makes the most sense and I might scoot this over a little bit as well. That looks like the middle. Honestly, if it's not the middle, I think that's fine. I probably also need to bring it down a little bit. I think maybe that location is better. What if I like made the bathroom long? This is the point where I can't place it myself. That is good to note. So I'll keep that right there. That means we only have one counter to clutter and i think i'll probably clutter this one and they can like just chop up on the side so these are just like recipe books then we can have like our plant right there you will have to move the plant to get to the paper towels but i think that's fine and yeah i think that's pretty cute actually i'm pretty sure i can move it back a little bit yeah i have like so much room to move it back i might actually move the plant to be over here and then put the candles right here that is definitely not the best place to put the candle but i i 
I kind of like it, you know? Or I could just find another space for it. That is also an option. I could probably put it on this table. Okay, yeah, that's definitely the middle. That's beautiful. And it would probably be nice to get like some peachy color curtains to match this pink color. I mean, these are from Desert Lux and they actually work. I really hate how there's like a visual glitch. I just hate how that happens. It's so annoying. It like ruins the curtains for me. I would love to put a bookshelf in here. The question is just what bookshelf should I get? I mean, we have so many bookshelf options and I still feel like I don't really like many of them. I don't know if I like that. Like, does that look good? What if I use the round one? I don't like the colors of the bookshelf with the round one. I like these colors better. Anyways, I made the bathroom this big because I kind of wanted to do this thing where I put like these two counters and then I could like get maybe two bathroom sinks and then I could use like the step stool in front of one of the sinks so maybe there's a child using it. I like the idea of it and we could probably even size it down so this part is just like decoration this one is functional like I think that's very cute and then for the tile I was thinking of this one I don't know if it comes in the right color it has like that orangey color to it but it also has blue which probably isn't the worst thing so I think this is what we'll go for I probably should focus on one room maybe I can place the dining room table kind of in the middle of everything like I think that's pretty good I kind of want to put a wall right here and then maybe that's where the trash can and stuff can go Ooh, this comes in that nice peachy color or pink color I don't know I say pinky peach I think this is like a pinky peach color that is cute we can get like some beautiful aprons and then I probably should pick some wallpaper for this room so it could be nice to have like a brick accent so I think maybe the white brick is pretty fine or we could go with like this kind of brick color which honestly I do like this but maybe not I kind of like the white brick more but then I also like this as an accent wall like oh that's so pretty I mean we can get like two accent walls like that's there's nothing wrong with two accent walls right maybe the white brick is too much maybe I'll use this and then we would probably need a more normal wallpaper what if we did it in blue I know that's weird we don't really have blue anywhere else else but well actually no we do have blue somewhere we have blue right here is the blue weird I kind of like it because there's blue here there's some blue in the books so I think this might be nice and then I could possibly get like a frame tv I'm so sorry that this is not going to be a limited pack build I'm so sorry but I just love using everything so I can see if it works with anything else and I think with just space game it would be too hard maybe I can get these likes next to the tv we can get this like nice little table okay this glitch is really bothering me it's like ruining the whole build because i just keep seeing it this is from discover university i think i might use this and then maybe we could grab like some entrance stuff so like we have this mail carrier that i'm gonna size down we have these bags i don't think i can really fit in a mirror honestly i could put a mirror in this room so actually scratch that and then i'll just put more books because why not but i don't really put any mirror mirrors in other rooms besides like the bathroom and the bedrooms so this could be nice I don't know it's trendy before you walk out you can like take your outfit of the day picture right here um you might just have to move the coffee table but I think this is pretty nice I can get like a little bit of clutter in this bookshelf so I could put like these beautiful blue books I can put these sticky notes Ooh, and then I kind of want to get like a taxi car that's nice and I think that's it for this whole space I guess I can get like an entrance mat but then I think that's probably it or instead of this rug I could probably use that in the bathroom and then I could probably get a rug under the dining table oh we could use this rug from the loft kit I think that might be better I don't know if I like the white I want it to be like this beigey color actually and then I'm gonna work on the bathroom it's probably gonna be really simple in here so the toilet is gonna go over here and then maybe I could put like a plant and some tissues I actually might alt place it so it's a little bit better and not clipping in with the plant so I think that's good and actually I wonder if I could put like the shelf in here so that way I can like use the pink color and then it brings it all together and I also want to size it down so hopefully it can still snap stuff to it yes it does it goes to the same height I realized that usually the recent shelves have been doing that and I think it's been since like the greenhouse haven kit where when you size the shelf down the slot placement stays so the 
that way it's at the same height and I think that's just pretty cool so this is kind of perfect because it has like all the right colors except for the orange but I think that is fine I'm just gonna like alt place it a little bit I also want to get this up here and the red shelf is just to help me place the stuff correctly so I might just get like a little razor part of me is like maybe it should be down here I think it's like way too high up okay that is definitely better so then we have this painting and I kind of want to put it in this bathroom and I think we could probably get one with the message on it like this one I think that's cute I actually don't like these towels I feel like they're a little too plain so maybe we'll get a few with like some color maybe the yellow is better then I'm gonna alt place these toothbrushes and a soap dispenser yeah like that I think that's good I also think I want to change the color to this color I think the white or the beige was just too plain but I think that's the bathroom it's pretty simple I did forget to get this and then moving on to this office space I think I might actually want to alt place this because it slots here and I want to slot it to the end I think that's better I'll put it in that yellow color and then I think I want to use this painting again like I could use it probably twice there's like this cute swatch and then there's this cute swatch that is very beautiful I don't know what these people do but like what if they paint and maybe I could use this rug again I know it's crazy to like use it over and over but like it's new so I could use it in like this blue color or is that weird I mean I could use it in this color so that will be fine and then all we need is just like a little desk I mean honestly maybe a desk could go in the parents bedroom and then this could be like more of a skill building room so I could put like an easel I could put like a bonsai tree we have plenty of things that we could add here I think this is so pretty as a skill building room so I use this wallpaper from the storybook nursery kit and it kind of has like this green tint to it so I wanted to use it I don't know if it's weird but I do like it so hopefully you like it too and then I thought I would just put like a little chair over here we still didn't use the poof yet but I think I want to save that for the bedroom maybe I could get this book nook kit one and maybe that's perfect and then I could possibly grab another one of these lights they got this for sale it was like buy one get one free or something buy one get one half off that works so the hallway is pretty simple I just put like a bench the family bulletin board and the desk area and a thermostat so that is pretty simple I think I will start off with the parents bedroom and we could probably use some windows in here I don't know if I really want to stick to like the windows they are already using so I'll use these ones which are floor to ceiling height but we'll start off maybe in the kids bedroom or the teenagers actually no I feel like it kind of has to be like a kids bedroom because why do you need a stepping stool if a child the thing is like a child can reach the sink so like this would probably need to be for a toddler but that was the whole idea but I could probably do that for another build if I think it all the way out so maybe I'll give this child or a teenager a bookshelf a very tall bookshelf that they need the stepping stool for I also probably need to figure out what color I want to go for Ooh, green is so cute because like I don't think I want to go with the rest of the house's color theme since this is a whole nother room like they have their own thoughts even though this is definitely this style of the rest of the house oh this is a very cute bookshelf that one might be cute but I don't think it's the one I want to go for I honestly feel like I don't like any of these options maybe this one is fine and then I'll just have this like in the corner and then I could like get some book clutter on top of it oh I did size it down so maybe I'll size it back up Ooh, maybe they have a diary that's very cute Ooh, we could have like this math clutter on top of it oh the sticky notes they are kind of like hanging off maybe that's better or we could get these books I don't think it actually slots to the middle of it but yeah that is so cute and now a part of me is wondering like should I do like a gold accent in here I think that's actually cute maybe I'll put this in the parents bedroom because they don't have anything from the kit and then for the rug I was thinking of this one from the for rent pack we could probably size it down a little bit like that's perfect I do like it in this color too I don't know it's green but I feel like it's too much green but then I feel like this is too much white so I might just stick with the all green one. Ooh, what if we did like zebra print I don't think that's good wait a minute okay look this is crazy but that kind of matches what if we like try to do this color scheme of like the reddish orange and the green maybe that's not so good we could do like the blue I don't know I'm trying to be like creative I'm trying to think outside of the box you could always just do like this half wallpaper but I don't know I don't think this is 
really fun. This is fun. And then we could possibly go with this boring wallpaper. I just called it boring, but I'm going for it. And then there's these like very light green curtains from Eco Lifestyle that I want to use. I think this is looking really good so far. And I'm thinking I want to use this bed just because like it's the right green color to match the curtains. Honestly, the blue is also cute. Honestly, this rug is so beautiful because it actually matches this perfectly. I'm kind of like rethinking the color scheme we're going for. Like, I don't know. I think this might be cuter. And then maybe we'll just stick to the silver. I think I'm liking the blue better, honestly. I might use the Desert Luxe curtains because they do have like this blue color or like this light blue color. So that might be good. I do want the window to kind of be like centered with the rug. I know that's probably weird, but it is kind of bothering me that it's not centered. So maybe that is fine. And then we can like think about a nightstand and what else could probably go in this room. Ooh, maybe that is nice. What if they're into the beach? Maybe not. Maybe not. I don't think I ever used that painting before in that swatch. I don't know if like any painting is right. Oh, I guess this is fine. And then maybe the teenager streams. That's kind of like what I'm thinking about, but I'm very unsure if that's what I want. I don't know, like with the little couch setup, I'm thinking like the couch could be like either a backdrop or we could pretend they do like comedy routines in front of this area and like maybe they record it or they do a podcast. Obviously, this is just pretend but I don't know I feel like I want to put a mic just for the vibes I don't know I like that and then we could put like a desk against this wall so I was thinking that this person could be transgender so I did give them like a nice PC setup and some clutter on a desk and this is weird but I'm kind of thinking we need another rug but obviously that would be too many they also don't have a dresser but I could give them a mirror sometimes I don't give my sims dressers just because like it doesn't fit and I don't think it's that important to have and I also also might just put the mirror behind here because I think that looks good. So this is a very simple room. What if they play the guitar? I could put the guitar right here but then there's still something missing. You can never have too many plants but like is that good? They should have like maybe some high school years posters. Ooh like the cow plants. I love the cow plants. Okay so this is their room and I know this is bad but like the whole point of this build is so I can use the new stuff so I kind of also want to use the rug for a third time so I'm thinking I could use this because it has like the reddish orange color and then I would love to find a bed that matches this vibe. I was looking at this bird earlier and it has the blue so I think that's cool. I don't know if we have like this correct color though but we do have this correct color in counters. I know that's so weird like just to use like a counter as a nightstand that is crazy. I have another idea instead of like this part we could use cabinets it's like a floating nightstand. I just have to figure out which one I like more. I feel like I probably would use the dream home decorator one. Okay, honestly looking at it, maybe this color is not so perfect, but it's close. Like it's the Sims 4. It's the closest we're gonna get to it being like the same shade. I can get this little llama. We could probably get another lamp as well. Maybe this is cute. And I can get like this cityscape. And then maybe this person wears glasses. I think that's pretty fine. And then on the wall I was kind of thinking we could use these paintings so I like the default swatch and then maybe we could use this one that is beautiful and then we need a wallpaper so there's actually a pretty good wallpaper that matches this orangish reddish color I don't know if we like that or not we probably don't have enough blue we could use this as like another accent wall and then I'll give them like a dresser actually eco lifestyle also comes with this color of curtain so I think that might be good I kind of want to put like two poofs. Honestly, it's kind of bothering me. I don't think this wallpaper is like the right color at all. I thought it was. It's close. It is really close. Well, that can just be the blue wallpaper. I don't really know if they can walk past here. I mean, they should be able to, but the sims can be a little weird. I don't know. Maybe one person sleeps in here, or I could just move it right here. This room is coming together. And then for an activity for the parents, we do have this whole activity room with like an easel and a bonsai tree, so maybe we can try to do some something different like a candle making machine. I don't really use that ever. We have this nicer woodworking table. It's very useful. I'll put this little tool thingy on the wall and then we could get like a book cover. That is really nice. I think I want the mirror to be next to the dresser actually. I'll put the plant right here and then I guess I can just put like the poofs next to it. Oh I do like this painting. I kind of want to use it right here. That is like the right 
colors. I feel like this room might be complete. Nothing being right here is kind of bothering me, but like what else could I possibly put? I mean, they don't have a bookshelf. Maybe this is fine. But yeah, I think that room is complete. So pretty much we are done with this apartment. I think it turned out very nice. And I guess we could possibly put this light in the living room as well. But for a little tour, this is what we did with the living room. It is very beautiful. I love the color scheme that we went for. This is a very nice pack. And then this is like the little dining room. This is the kitchen. We have a nice little bookshelf. And then this is our hallway. So I put like a little desk. This is like the office space. So it has like a radio. It has an easel and it has a bonsai tree. And then this is the bathroom. It is also very simple. This is the teen's bedroom. Um, so yeah, I love this little space. It's very cute. And then this is the main bedroom. So they have a woodworking table, a dresser, a mirror, all that good stuff. And now I have to put a light switch everywhere. Thankfully, I did not forget. They might not be at the right locations just because I think that's very hard. Like, I guess I could do this and then like I'll place it, but it's fine. You're not gonna look at them at the same time. This one can be for like the hallway. I don't really know. One for the living room, one for the kitchen. And then maybe this is for like the dining room and the hallway. But yeah, I guess I should upload this to the gallery. First, I am gonna paint the walls and I hope nothing gets deleted. I probably shouldn't jinx myself like that. So as usual, I have to delete all the walls to upload this apartment. So I called it the Cozy Kitchen Apartment. Um, I don't know what the best thumbnail picture will be. I guess this one will just have to work. So I will upload it. It is valued at 54,000 simoleons. That is crazy. Um, I don't know if it actually uploaded. Okay, it seems like it did, so that is good. Um, obviously I used a lot of stuff so sorry hopefully you can understand but i think i'm gonna leave this video off here and let me know what you think about this pack because honestly this pack would probably be at the top of my list if i made a ranking video but i'm gonna leave this video off here if you enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe i love you you are important and i will see you guys tomorrow bye